Hey there, friends. On today's video, I'm going to show you how to download and enable your Trust Wallet on your iPhone. Okay, so we're currently on my iPhone and what we want to get is the Trust Wallet. And this will enable us to be able to buy and trade some alternative cryptocurrencies that aren't available on the bigger exchanges like Coinbase or Gemini. So I'm going to go straight into my App Store. Now, again, if you're using an Android, this is going to be a very similar process. You're just going to need to go to your Google Play Store. Now, as you can see, I typed in Trust Wallet up top. And then as you can see, Trust Wallet is the second option down there. So I'm going to go ahead and click the Get button. Okay, once it's through downloading, we can just click the Open button. And now we're going to create a brand new wallet. Now, again, for you new folks to cryptocurrency, a wallet is a digital storage place for your cryptocurrencies. So basically what we're doing is we're just setting up a nice secure location where you can store the cryptocurrencies that you're purchasing or trading. So let's go ahead and click on create a new wallet. Now, be sure to read the privacy policy and the terms of service so you know what you're signing up for. Once you've done that, you can click the I've read and accept the terms and then click continue. All right, from here, we are going to back up our wallet. Now, this is really, really important. One of the most important steps of setting up your wallet. You're going to see 12 words, and these are the phrases that are going to allow you to recover your wallet in the event that you forget your password. Very, very, very important. Write these things down. Store it in a very, very secure location. Once you do this, remember, you need to save these things or else you're not going to be able to access your cryptocurrency in the future. So once you understand this, you can check the box at the bottom. And what I'll do is fast forward through this next section because these are secure words for me and we'll jump back into it. Okay, as you can see, the wallet was created successfully. So what happened is I needed to re-input my security phrases and that basically lets the app know that yes, you have saved these somewhere where you can access them in the future. Again, keep those phrases safe and secure. All right, let's click the okay button. And that is it. It's really nice because you don't have to input any kind of personal security information. This wallet is currently set up and we're actually ready at this point to receive, send, and even purchase cryptocurrency right here on the app. Friends, I hope that helps. Again, it's a super simple tutorial. Should get you up and running. If this has helped, hit that thumbs up button. Let's us know we're making good videos and subscribe because we're making a bunch more trust wallet tutorials right now. Thanks so much for watching and we'll see you again on the next one.